Hey y'all, coming to you from International Headquarters of Scotty DTV, but I was at the 2020 Grand National Roadster Show in Pomona, California, and I came across a 1964 Lincoln Continental I think y'all are going to like. Let me get the camera turned around and take a quick look at it. I dig these fourth generation Lincoln Continentals. Just classy cool. You don't have to do nothing to them, you know, just slam them to the ground and get everything straightened out on them. And they are just, like I said, classy, cool, elegant cars. Car that makes you think about cruising the strip in Vegas. I don't know why, but, you know, cruising the, you know, the boulevard down in Biloxi would work just fine too. But something about Lincoln Continentals in Vegas, right? I mean, Vegas is about high rolling and Lincoln's about high rolling. So they just seem to go together. And if I'm going to dream about driving it, you know, I'm dreaming making my dream right I dig it though I like what they did with the interior they were bench seats so they've made some bucket seats put a console in there I like that I like the color of it I like you know that they left all the trim on it, it still looks the way that it would have looked I like those wheels they're kind of they're heavy looking heavy duty not in cumbersome but in you know looks like they're a good solid wheel Look at that grill. It's called an electric razor grill, right? I'm good with it. It works for me. Any of these suicide door Lincolns I'm cool with. Very nice job on the interior. It would have been a column shift, I believe, and they've moved it to the floor. Some cup holders. You gotta have cup holders. You're gonna have to have a cold drink while you're driving around with the top down. Sun kicking on top of you, right? Very comfortable looking, usable. One that looks like, yeah, you know, it was built to a nice level, but it was also built to drive. I dig the dash. It all works for me. Yeah, I would uh, I'd get parked that in the garage and take it out on sunny days. I'd even drive it in Tennessee. And obviously I couldn't find a bunch of information on the car. As far as the uh, any modifications that have been made to it. It's a unibody car, so I always wonder on those, did they put a chassis up underneath it? You know, there's the big deal. Got a 5.0 up under the hood. But, you know, I like how they did the paneling with the little chrome bars on it. It looks like something that would have came from Lincoln. And I like how they took the cover and took it all the way back to the firewall so that there's, you know, it hides all that stuff there. And then color matched it. It is, I think they did a very nice job of installing that 5.0 in there. Well, if you see that in your rear view mirror, you know, you gotta move over. There's a VIP behind you. Very clean. Up under the hood, finished all that up too. Just a nice, nice clean car all the way around. I thought it was cool. I figured y'all would want to see it. Grand National Roadster Show. Cool cars for sure. So there you go from the 2020 Grand National Roadster Show. 1964 Lincoln Continental. Hope y'all have enjoyed it. See ya! Hey y'all, make sure you subscribe to this channel and visit scottydtv.com for an easy way to search the hundreds of videos I have posted. Either click the link in the description or the one at the end of this video.